All right, now we go for the women's side of the Royal Rumble. First off, Natalia. Um, I don't really know if Natalia. Again, I've said this a lot already, but if you want them to do it, have her have one final run with a title, this would be the time to do it. Let her win the Rumble. If not, maybe top four, maybe final three, maybe something like that. Bailey's not going to win because, you know, they have the tag titles and they want to push Bailey and Sasha as the fucking um, tag champs. So just, you know, let Bailey just lose and just do whatever. Sasha's only in this because if she loses the Rumble, which we said earlier, she will. So Sasha's in the match. She'll be eliminated just so they have the fucking tag titles. Ember Moon. I don't know of Ember Moon. She has all the potential in the world to be great, to be a world champion. But I don't know if they'll do it. I want them to, but I don't think they will. So I will say final four, a dark horse for dark horse for sure. But I I don't think they'll do it. All of the Riot squads: Ruby, Ruby Riot, Sarah Logan, and Liv Morgan. Ruby Riot, they're off and on with her. I'll say final six, final four. Sarah Logan has a lot of potential. I will say Final Four, but only if the Riot Squad's all in there in the end. And just see what happens there. Liv Morgan on the other hand is fucking gold. She's young now. She's She has all the potential in the world to be a world champion. I say Liv gets the upset win and wins the Rumble. If not, probably top eight, top six. Alicia Fox has no chance in this fucking rumble. Mandy Rose, same thing. Sony Deville, maybe top eight, maybe final six. Selena Vega, maybe again, final six, final four. And Carmella, who won the number three spot with the fucking Mix Max challenge with fucking R Truth of all people. Now, unlike R Truth, Carmella has a lot of potential to win this thing. I will say Final Four, if not Final Two. But with all the future entries in this match, I don't know if they'll do it. But I will say that she has better odds than our truth, that's for sure. And finally, the Universal Title match, Brock Lesnar versus Braun Strowman. I've said it before, but I will say it again. Braun should be the fucking champion. He should have been the champion years ago. He should have been the champion when he first fucking got on the fucking roster. That's how impressive this guy is. If Braun does not win the fucking title, get rid of him. You're not gonna use him. You're not using him properly. He's a fucking machine. He's the fucking best thing on the fucking show every week. Just make it the fucking Braun show. Just fucking do it. I mean, God, how do you not give him the title? That's what I'm surprised about. I mean, sure, you had the Roman thing, and then, you know, you had to have something happen. But give him the title just once, just to see him with the fucking Universal title would be incredible. Just do it, WWE. For once in your life, do the right thing. Give Braun the fucking title. And with that, the Royal Rumble. Jesus fucking Christ is 18 days away. Give Braun the title, for fuck's sake.